In this world we have monstrous men and witchy women who like to abuse people's lives. They play in us with their friends, but what they're really doing is stealing from them from behind. And what I can talk about is that I have experienced this in a way I never thought possible. Not only did I have siblings and parents that took from me life, liberty, and happiness, but they lied in records to ruin me, and I don't have to trust them ever in this lifetime. I also had friends who played at me and said, we're friends, but then they literally abandoned me. I also had plenty of professional people in my network who, when they heard I lost my wife, didn't say one fucking thing to me because that relationship was basically over by then. I also had an insurance agent who kept trying to talk to me about mental health. I was about ready to bitch slap her across her office. I was not there to discuss her past life, but that's her, and that is on her. But what she failed to do was to protect my records. Now, what I can say to you is that there are shitbags in every community. There are people who think they have rights to you and rights to me. But we have to really get back to the basics. Biden back to the basics is as best we can get to. The reality is that American continent was built on Christianity. American continent was built on the concept of the pursuit and the love of the Lord Most High. The American continent was impacted when the people who already were indigent to our nation started to help us to thrive. But what do we do to thank them? We went off and killed most of them. How rude were we? We also met a lot of predators in their communities that didn't like us, were terrified for us, of us, and our white skins, and they were called red skins. But we don't have to go back in history to figure out how far we've come as a society. What we have come to in society is what we need to keep growing through as a, without, I should say, any notoriety. And I'm not trying to rhyme, really. I'm just trying to say, look, it's time, America, to be right in the world. To be right in the world, you have to know what your rights are. To be right in the world, you have to know where your rights do not go. And when you're right in the world, then your life is right, and you're succeeding and going the right way. But when you're not right in the world, your life is not right, you're living in poverty, you're living in stupidity, you're living in aggressiveness, you're living in badness, you're living in shitville, and you have to get that today. Sure, it's possible that you're a real looker and you can go off and be a trophy wife to some rich bastard. But here's the reality. At some point, he's just going to replace you with something else. What's next? Who's next? You see, men of richness, we learned from Trump, like to have their cake and eat it too. And that's the mentor that we want for our life? I don't think so. Do you? When I'm talking about Biden back to, ba back to basics, the reason I supported him, the reason I wanted to vote for him before some little bastard in the community took my court so I couldn't get online to do any voting when I was absent from my community, is that openly because he's a lawyer and the entire American continent is built on laws. We have the laws of our nation. We have the laws that govern us when we live and move ourselves overseas. We have the laws that are regarding our lives that keep us safe from the predators of the world who want to come here and ruin America. We also have the laws in every fucking industry, you stupid shits, that require you to know what the laws are governing your industry. There's laws of construction, there's laws of real estate, there's laws of finances, there's laws of banking, there's laws of restaurants, there's laws of consumerism, there's laws of every industry. There's laws on safety. There's laws on QS 9000, ISO 16. Sorry, I get the numbers wrong, but it's been a long time since I've been in manufacturing. There are laws. And those laws keep every single human worker safe. 